Mars has two tiny potato-shaped moons that may be captured asteroids. Last month, Perseverance turned the zoom lens of its color camera toward the sun in time to capture video of Deimos passing in front of it on this episode of Mars Guy. Perseverance is designed to explore Jezero Crater and search for interesting rocks to sample. Here's Mars Guy for scale. Hopefully those samples will be returned to Earth someday. Perseverance also can turn its cameras toward interesting rocks in space. The Martian moons called Phobos and Deimos are tiny compared to our moon, and because they're so small, they don't have a nice round shape. For decades, there's been speculation that they're either captured asteroids from the asteroid belt or chunks of rock lofted off Mars by giant impacts. The orbits of Phobos and Deimos are so well known that scientists can predict to within less than a minute when one of them will pass in front of the sun as viewed from any point on the surface of Mars. We'd call that an eclipse for our moon, but Mars moons are so small that they never fully eclipse the sun, so better to call them transits. On January 20th at 8.41 in the morning, Perseverance turned Mascam Z toward the sun to catch a predicted transit of Deimos. With its neutral density filter blocking 99.9999% of the light, it started shooting frames at about one per second, catching the tiny black speck that is the shadowed side of the potato moon. The rotation of Mars is what gives rise to the rising sun, which makes it look like Deimos is standing still. It looks different with Phobos, which is closer and orbiting Mars at a faster speed. In this case, the motion of Phobos dominates the apparent motion of the rising sun. The sun rises at 725 over the Pinacate volcanic field in Mexico, where I'm working with a team to compare lava flows here to ones on Mars, including in Jezero Crater. So I need to keep this episode short. Look for a full-length episode again next week.